Upside down castle. Got me my Chrysogrim. Ah, oh, easy mode activated. This is all places I've already been, so I think the save spot here... I can go through it, yeah? No? Looks like we go that way! Pretty much effectively beat the game. Woohoo, life up! So, we can either go this way or we can go back and go keep going up. It's actually a pretty inventive idea for, uh, you know, like, Game Plus, I guess. You know, flip the map upside down. Wonder if any other games tried that. Lots of thorn weeds. Stone skull. It literally doesn't matter. Oh, yeah, I forgot about those little spiky blade thingamajiggies. Yeah, those things. Uh, we want to go up or down? Let's go down. Oh, -ho. watch your fingers. Hey, you're not gonna get me. No, sir. Hello, Andy234. How are you this evening? Got ourselves a meal ticket. <laughs> it's all right. I understood that. Yeah, I don't speak Spanish, but I definitely understood that. Ah, it got me. It actually did kind of a lot of damage, too. That Nova Skeleton. Let's see what's up here. 
Glad that those little, uh... Little spike wheel things are only in that one spot. It'd be kind of annoying if they were, like, all over the place. Got ourselves a Zircon. Anything hidden? And it being upside down is throwing me off, but, like, kind of sort of don't know where I'm at. If I can go up there. I don't know if that's a, uh... Oh, yeah, hidden spot. What's that, a diamond ring? Diamond? Nothing there. So let's go up here, I guess. Thank you. I've actually already beat the, uh, 100% of the, uh, first castle. And I was able to rescue, uh, Richter Belmont. Right now I'm working on the, uh, 200%. Last night's stream, I was able to, to obtain the uh, Chrysogrim, which is the uh, sword I'm using right now. Which, in my opinion, is the uh, most powerful sword in the game. I like the fact that it swings without you having to, like, do anything. Or without stopping, so you can, like... Oops. That was cool. Didn't mean to do that, but... Got my sword familiar that my chat helped me get. Yeah, last night, yesterday's stream, chat helped me find it. It's actually pretty well hidden, too. Almost got hit by that thing. Let's see. I want to go this way. Get out of here, Imp. What are you doing? Trying to be all impish. What's that, a garnet? An oh, opal, huh? Is there a hidden? Nothing hidden. Yeah, those guys, if you, uh, if they get to you, they'll, like, sort of mind control you and, like, make you aimlessly attack over and over. And you can't move while they're doing it. So, nothing really that way. there's anything hidden here, no? <laughs> I think that was a shiitake mushroom. That's funny, the water's flowing upside down too. Another mushroom? Shiitake! Get wrecked, Rock Knight! Oh, something with enough health to last a barrage. But now that I know how much health they have. Yeah, activate easy mode. Oh, 
Oh, two levels. That was quick. Spy hander. Hmm, is it the mist? That pentagram, huh? That pentagram. So there was a button in the other one. In the upside right one. So weird seeing the water going up. Mushroom. Uh, Asufun Katana, huh? Was that a two-handed thing? Oh, yeah. It's not better than the Chrysogrim, though. Huh? Oh, yeah, that's like a... It was like a little pedestal. Up here? Yeah, I think it's just like a little kind of ice crystal-y looking thing, I think. First. I think that leads to a boss. Get out of here, cave trolls. Hello, Perito Monroe. How are you? A dark octopus. What was that? Ooh, there's a big bag of money. So my last stream, I was able to get the Chrysogrim, so now I'm kind of like a powerhouse just plunging through this game now. Ooh, is that Alucard Shield? Yeah, Alucard Shield. Let's sort it. And let's equip Alucard Shield. Passed it up. Alucard Shield. Yep. Strong versus all attacks. 35 defense. And the second part to the uh, Shield Rod combo. And it looks cool. A little killer fish, huh? Get out of here, killer fish. Dude, we're gonna try to explore all the map. So I gotta make sure we jump everywhere. Big go bag of money. Oh, you little butthead. You got me. I got got. Let's turn back into the dude. 
Get out of here, cave trolls. Man, leveling up like a boss. So, that is... Hmm, how do I explore that? Did I get it? No? Hmm. I think I might need to go... Get it? Uh, that's gonna be a bother, I think. And I can't go in the water as a bat. Nope. Turn into a rocket. I think we're no, we're not quite maxed. All right, let's see if I can fight this boss. Hey, I got my, uh, stopwatch. Do I want this? No, nah, we don't want that. So this is where he was talking about on the first map for going in wolf form, right? somebody in the chat yesterday mentioned that you could gain access to a path or something inside here maybe it's like something you have to jump to hmm I wonder if anybody knows. If you know what the secret in, is for that, let me know. I can't seem to figure it out. So... So we'll go down here. Hopefully there isn't any more of those, uh... Those little wheel spike thingamajiggies. Yeah, that'll work. Let's see... Right now I'm just kind of just exploring some of the map. Just kind of being very linear right now. Fire boomerang. At some point, I'll get in there and, like, make sure I get all, all the clues or all the hidden stuff. But for right now, I'm just trying to find, uh, explore most of the map. Because I think I might have missed... One or two items in the, uh, other castle. Go ahead and save it. Take a drink. So that's fully explored. Let's go back to that door there. Oh, man, he's got no ups at all. Oh, snap. Taking hits. I'm taking hits. Do 
the shield rod is in the very bottom, which on this map, I guess, is the very top? Yeah, I think so. So I think we can go this way, right? Yeah, yeah. Show sure enough. Hoo hoo. That was one of those flea men. Pretty sure that's what was on there. Get out of here. Yeah, come on. Get some. Slash! Eh. Holy Cross will be alright. So we get an uncurse, or anti-venom, and a hammer, huh? So that's the way... Uh, in? Out? I guess? Uh, something like that? Ooh, come on. Come on! Ooh, that hurt a lot. No! Nova Skeleton, bad! That was a bad Nova Skeleton. Not too much enemies that bleed. Would be no issue if I had the, uh, shield. So I usually rock the... Alucard shield with the shield rod and then switch back to the Chrysogrim. And when I need to heal, I'd pop it out. Eh, we don't need that. I mean, I guess for the uh, clock room, I'll need it. So that's back that way. Looks like everything's explored there. That's a cranky fish, man. Keeps randomly flailing around the tank. I think I, I think my reflection is startling him. Hello, Duda, Dada. Sorry if I mispronounce your name. So I think I already got all the all the stuff here. Could try to make it into the waterfall. Fall down this way. Make sure I get all these ledges. Hopefully everyone in chat's having a good night. I had a pretty long day at work. Nice to come home and just relax and play a... Excellent game. Especially now that I had to log off right after I got my Chrysogrim. I didn't even really get to use it. So, have I been in here yet? No, I have not. I... Oh, ho, ho, he got me. And I feel like something's not running. Be here enabled. Let's get off that. All right. Go back to the game. 
All right. Oh, this is where Death's at. Ooh, he is pissed. Well, too bad for you, son. Get wrecked. Oh, there's another one, huh? Get out of here. So, do I want to fight death already? We're working directly towards the shield rod. So, I think if I keep going this way, it should be a save. Yep, save point. Go ahead and save it. And we'll go ahead and, uh, I guess I'll go ahead and just wreck Death's face off. Shouldn't have taken all my stuff. There you go, meanie head. I can't see. Oh, you little... So it hit my shield, but it can't block that big ass fireball, so give me my holy fire. I think these were the uh boss. The first boss, I think. Get a little dialogue? Yeah, maybe. Yep, little dialogue. So you've made it this far. In the name of your father, cease this foolishness. Not while there's a breath in my body. Uh, I don't think and I do. Master, I'll feast on your soul this night. I got two of them, I think. I should get a third one off this, off death. Get out of here. Chris Grimm is just way too powerful. Yep, there's the Eye of Lod. So, relics. I got the Tooth of Lod, the Ring of Lod, the Eye of Lod. Ooh, that's plus 10 luck. Nice. But yeah, I don't have all of the stuff yet. A couple more I'm missing. I should get quite a few of them in the inverted castle. I I don't have all of it explored yet. I think I have all the relics from the from the uh, regular castle though, so we'll see. My uh, chat was helping me yesterday find all the stuff I was missing. Uh, I think to push that button, we got to switch over to the the uh, demon. Hopefully he doesn't destroy our ears with the painful... Oh, is she he not going to press it? There he goes. Hmm. Oh, come on, don't... This switch hasn't been pressed yet. That is so bad. Dude, you could have got somebody in off the street to perform that voice acting, and it would have been a lot better. So bad. Ooh, 174 crit. Oh yeah, I gotta get the gas cloud to turn the mist form into poison. Welcome to the stream, Mike. Was that a dead end? Can't remember if there's a hidden wall or not. Oh, yep, there she blows. Dracula not dead? Nope. I only got here yesterday. 
But I pretty much made it to the library of the inverted castle and then got the chrysogram and then I had to quit out because I had to go to bed. So I get to go up now, I think. Jump. Ooh, a bunch of bats. And that demon doesn't do anything. Let's turn the sword back on. At least he tries. No, they don't... They don't care about being in bat form. Slash! Slice! I don't like that secondary. Oop, crap. Yeah. I actually like them all. Is that Alucard's sword? Yep. Unfortunately, it is not as good. Oh, I have the ghost. I don't think I've even used the ghost yet. Like my, f what? This one's my favorite. I like the ghost, the little just floating head. Uh, let's see here. So where's Alucard's sword? Poisoned Executioner Sword. Ooh, that gives you a defense. There she is. Mother's Family Heirloom. 93 attack. Good grief. Pretty cool. If I didn't have a Chrysogrim, I'd probably be using it. Can't beat that multiple strikes, though. You want to go in there or keep going up? Uh, I think this leads to a save. Oh, a teleporter. Do I even have another teleporter anywhere? Nope, not yet. Yeah, right now I'm just trying to like go through the castle. I'm not really being too careful of what I'm looking for. I'm just trying to explore the map. So far, I think the music tracks from the from the other not inverted castle is better. Maybe I just haven't found a, a cool spot yet. So far, my favorite music is from the uh, clock tower area. Maybe we'll get lucky. Eh. Not really. Yeah, they definitely went with a lot darker theme for this area. Oh, -hoo -hoo. Throwing cats at me? Seriously? 
Oh. Goodness, this lady's a pain in the butt. It does sound like it's saying meow. It's that or ow. I'm just gonna pretend it's ow. It's been a while since I've done that move. I'm gonna zone over and back, respawn those bats. Oh, you guys got wrecked. Oh, come on. With the bats just all up in my face. Oh, definitely not that. Doo -doo -doo. Oh. Get out of here, you. Ha ha ha. Oh! Get him, ghost! Ah, oh, the silly putty's pretty good. So, spike breaker armor, go! Get wrecked, spikes. There we go. Is the platinum armor good? 27 defense. Walk armor is 38. Oh, those blood skeletons get up fast, the yellow ones. No, get out of here, you. Running away. Get her. Get her, ghost! Haha. Uh -huh. Bunch of karma coins. Resist fire and a resist thunder, huh? Jump up! That's a lot of blood skeletons, holy moly. I think we might be coming up to a boss. Maybe not. Another library card. That was one way that way. Looks like we gotta go the other way. One thirty. There's a one seventy four. That was a good one. Ah, uh, that thing's crap. Yeah, I don't think so, lady. Now let's try not to step on a spike that I didn't break. Good job! Ooh, 
we want to go that way. Oh. Oh, she. Ah, I totally missed her. Like, she blended in the background there for a second and I didn't see her. Oh, come on. I don't want that. Some of that dark metamorphosis, yo. Blood skeletons. We got ourselves a life up and a heart up. This is a boss, maybe? No? Another one of these ladies. I feel like if Alucard was real, this is how he would be. Just like, wrecking face. Just get out of my way, Skellington. Shield potion. An attack potion. Is this your shield rod? No. I think this is the, uh, one of the items dead. Yep. One of the items death took. The ring of J was it? Uh, plus five defense. Slowly getting our stuff back, going back to the way we were when we came in here. So we need to go up. Upsy daisy. So this should be a boss. I think this might end at a boss. Maybe? Maybe not. My one gold coin, huh? Oh, I accidentally picked up the stupid stopwatch. I wonder if... The moonstone, huh? So it improves after sunset. I... the sunstone? So apparently it's daytime right now. But yeah, that's pretty remarkable. Yeah, like it boosts everything, except defense goes down a little. Oh, that means you could like technically put both on. So this was what? Just says a. So that's plus one to that, plus one to that, plus one to that, plus. So it looks like just plus one to everything. So if we put that on, we could have a big boost to defense. Proves blood healing abilities. Now that was a good call, Mike, on the uh, Sunstone, Moonstone combo. Proves heal item power. Blood healing abilities. That little... So it looks like really the Ring of Pales is probably the better of everything. Those are just valuable. Up, oh, got ourselves a boss. We get a drink. Ah, 
All right, let's see here. Galmoth, huh? Ooh, snap, those things hurt. Get him! Get underneath him. Attack his foot! Destroy his foot! Ooh, man, he might actually get us. He, uh... Okay, we need to heal. He had way more health than I was expecting. To drink. Is there. Do I have a heal potion? Like a big one? Elixir. Restore all HP. Yes, please. Oh, come on. Thank you. Oof, that was a close one. Yeah, he was tough. Alright, get my shield back. Do, do, do. Where to go? Where to go? Got the card shield, thank you. Yeah, he was harder than death. <laughs> that little thing right there says rip. So another heart and another life. So far I have not died. That was very close, though. Ruby Circlet and the Gas Cloud. So, the Ruby Circlet does what? Oops. Restores HP by fire damage. Okay, so if I fight fire guys... Huh, I could have swore the shield rod was in this area. Hmm. Maybe not. Unless there's a hidden spot I missed. You know what? I think I know where the shield rod is, actually. I think it's kind of like, uh, where the clock room is. In that, uh, marble area, I think is No, not that. Marble is that one area. So we need to go all the way back. Oh, it looks like we did not go this way. So we gotta save. So this would have been a good spot to save before that boss. So that's a diamond? Yep. So I think probably before I go to bed, I'll use the library card and go sell some of these gems and see if there's anything I can pick up off of them. I think there might be a cloak I haven't bought yet. So we are trying to get that way.
Yeah, and the only thing that I don't like about the uh, Sunstone Moonstone is you can't tell what time of day it is. Unless there's a way to tell that I don't know. Haha, <laughs> you let him. Come on. Ah! Get wrecked, lady! I think it uses the clock in that one room. This is supposed to be on the, uh, you know, like the PlayStation 1. And I don't think the PlayStation 1 had a clock. Yeah, we were talking in the, in the uh, chat yesterday about ways they could, like, Make this game better if they ever did, like, a, re a remake. And adding an indicator. Ah. Thornweed, man. Ah, it's pokey! Adding some kind of indicator would be pretty cool. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that if you, uh, stood in that room and, like, looked at the... The hands on that clock you could probably determine like by switching them in and out and checking to see what time it was and stuff oh, I don't have a teleporter spot so I'm gonna have to walk yeah I didn't I didn't think of that until you mentioned the that it might be the system clock and first thought that came to my mind was like, but the PlayStation didn't have a system clock, and that's what made me think about the the clock in the game, because that's the only clock I can think of. Ah, oh, crap, I went the wrong way. Jump, jump. Get out of here, thornweeds. Nobody likes you. Oops. Well, that's a way to deal with them, haha. -ha. So, it looks like we can go straight across there. Also, need to explore the. that little up area. There's some fog of wars still there. Slagra, huh? I think these enemies right here are the f is the first boss. That little Gabion guy and that dude in the other room. Ah, no. Seriously, leave me alone, dude. Well, the music in here is not too bad. Go down. So it looks like we need to jump up here. Oh yeah, see we can go up in there. It looks like that's on the map, yep. So we got ourselves a potion. And a life up. Weak. Yep, okay. Those rock knights are pretty weak. Those blue Venus weeds actually have enough health that they're kind of a kind of a threat. Especially since there's spikes that they shoot up st actually still do a significant amount of damage. I think it hits for like 50 something. So that's all explored. 
Killer fish is minding his own business. There's a heart canister. Hello, Fernando. I actually haven't played that one. I played... This uh, this Castlevania and I think a 3D one. I think the 3D one was back on the uh, regular PlayStation as well. It might be it might have been PS2, but I th I'm pretty sure it was a PS1 game. Yeah. I'll have to try and remember that. Is it a side scroller like this? Ah. That might have been it. Uh, you can unlock Richter in this one too, I think. There's like a name code that you have to put in. Makes the game like super hard though. And there's definitely something not. My little Nightbot guy is like not. Not saying anything. He's supposed to be doing stuff. Let me try to log in and log out. Luckily, everybody's being pretty nice in the chat. Don't have to worry about any spam. Okay, are you ready to do your thing yet? Maybe? No? I guess we'll see. Alright. There we go. Welcome back, Nightbot. In Iraq, huh? I spent some time in Kuwait. When I was in the Air Force. Ah! Go back up. Oh, you... Bad timing. So I already went this way. I need to go... This way? Yep. I spent six months there. Back in, uh, 2004 to 2005. Oh, I, I was at Ali Asalim. I served six years in the Air Force. Oh yeah, you too, man. Yeah, I joined the Air Force back in 99 and got out in 2005. Yeah. I didn't like war, so... I had to part ways with the my service, but... Got a neutron bomb, huh? Pretty good item. I don't really use them because, like, you have to go into your inventory and everything. It'd be cool if there was, like, a, a quick, like, secondary button for, like, using... Yeah, they had a really good chow hall, that's for sure. 
Uh, I need to uh, reveal that fog of war stuff there. Oh, get an elixir. Sweet. Replace that elixir I had to chew on earlier. Is that revealed? Uh, I'm not going to be able to get that. I think it might be technically explored, but we'll... S as long as I get over 200... Or, yeah, over 200%, I'll be alright. There should be a... I think there should be a boss this way. Cave troll. Another neutron bomb. The hidden level? Yeah, are you talking about the inverted castle? By the entrance? Oh, where you use the wolf form? Back in the regular, uh, not inverted castle? I have not... I did not get that yet. I haven't gone back to the other castle yet. Yeah, and no, I haven't got it yet. I'm going to, though. Apparently, you're supposed to be able to do that, uh, wolf form thing on the inverted one, too, but I couldn't seem to get it to work. I didn't know what I was supposed to be doing, so... Yeah, I ran around inside it in wolf form and nothing seemed to happen. So it looks like I can't... Yeah, it seems like I'm not going to be able to get that stuff to reveal. Did I get anything here? No. I guess there's no boss here. So what's... We've got to keep going down. And, oh, there's a door I didn't go in. Oh, there's what's that? Ma mana prism? Yeah, I haven't played... You go through once as wolf, once as bat. Oh, okay. Yeah, I'll give that a try. Yeah, I played this... Probably around that time, 97 when it came out, 98 time frame. But then I saw that it was on the, uh, you could get it on the PS3. So I got it on the PS3 and did a playthrough of it on there. That was like, uh, maybe like six or so years ago, maybe. But then I was watching Netflix. And Netflix has got that Castlevania animation on there. And that inspired me to do another playthrough. And this time, since I'm into the YouTube thing, I figured I'd do like a... Aw, oh, a doppelganger, huh? Get out of here, me. Oh yeah, it's uh... I think it's kind of around Castlevania 3. It's following Trevor Belmont. It's pretty heinous, though. Like, well, I guess that's a bad term. It's a great show, but man, they chose to go very brutal with it. It's great, though. Like, it is really good. See, if you had had the Chrysogrim, you might have stood a chance, me. Now, it seems like I'm not getting my alerts either. So I'm getting subscribers and it's not telling me. Hold on a second. Uh, I think I might need to log... Log in and out. Log out. And log out. Log in. Uh, sadly, I don't know that much about the Castlevania storyline. Because, like I said, I only played this one. But this one won me over. And then when I saw the, uh... The Netflix one, 
the uh, Trevor Belmont in there, he's a total badass. But Richter's in this one, I'm pretty sure, and when you get to play as him, he's pretty weak. It seems pretty weak anyway, but obviously you just, you know... You're just starting the game, so... Uh, let's see here. Oh, I, lo I said log out, not close, you thing. Uh, sorry, I'm getting subscribers that aren't being, and it's not notifying me, so I'm trying to fix that real quick. Yeah, maybe. It's super good, though. It's only four episodes, sadly, and they're only like maybe like 28 minutes or whatever. Ugh, man, I don't want to have to log in all, all the time. Yeah, they did confirm that there is a second season. It'll have eight episodes. So it's going to be nice to see how, uh... Yep, that's right, Mike. Pretty sure that's what I heard, too. I'm hoping... that they, uh, come up with a really clever way of defeating Dracula, because, man, they made him seem like he is stupid strong. There we go. Ah, oh, what the heck? This thing keeps wanting to, like... Act like it's the first time I loaded it up. Is it there she is all right now maybe it'll notify me when I get a subscriber oop wrong button yeah yeah I watched it all four episodes oh all four episodes twice now I got me a pot roast. <laughs> yeah, wall chicken. I've eaten a couple of wall chickens so far. Well, not since I got this sword, though. In the beginning of the game, I definitely ate a couple wall chickens. What is that? Dark blade, huh? Dark blade. Dark blade. Sword forged by elves, huh? A little bit of defense. Pretty good attack on it. So there was no boss. That kind of sucks. Yeah, I found him. So there's the, uh, where is it? Uh, da, da, da. Yep, there's Alucard's sword. The uh, Alucard shield is right there. But yeah. 
kind of funny when you first get him, you're like, oh, cool, the Alucard sword, and it's like, nope. Definitely not the Alucard sword. But I got the Alucard sword now. Ah! I got the Alucard sword now. As well as the Alucard shield. Now I'm just trying to get the shield rod so I can do the little cheat move. Oh, oh trying to get me again. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I think they're... Yeah, they definitely weren't better than any of the weapons you get leading up to that. I think they're weaker by, like, five or something. So, I already went up there. Yeah, they weren't, like, total crap. Which would have been kind of funny if they would have been, like, just utter garbage. So, we can go this way. Nova Skeleton. Oh, ho, ho. I think that hit me right in the balls. Max Heart up again. Another one of these balloon things. Wait, did I already go this way? No. Oh, that'd be... That would have been useful. I ended up drinking a luck potion when I went to get the uh, Chrysogrim. Got it on the second schmoo I killed. The first one I tanked right in the face. He didn't drop it though. Then I drank the luck potion and he, it, the next one I killed. A little dagger in the beginning? Uh, I don't remember. Oh, actually, yeah, I did. The sword, the short sword you get, like, takes way too long to swing, so, like, I couldn't get out of the animation fast enough. So I kept getting hit by the, the uh, those little first skeletons you run into. Oh, I forgot I can break things in the mist form. So we can go either way. So this would have been where the one lady was? So maybe not. Peanuts. Go ahead and save just in case I get a error. Huh? Oh, beer, yeah. Definitely beer. Yeah, the combat knife, or the knife, was the animation was so much faster. He's gonna. <laughs> he totally popped that balloon. Like the first time my daughter lost a balloon, I think she cried. She frequents my chat now, so it's kind of funny. If I start talking about her, she might actually be in the chat. So we already went this way, so it looks like we can go down around 
down and then go that way, or we can go that way and up. Is it this way? No. Down. The zombies? Uh. Not sure. Not sure which one's yours. Ow. I knew that was gonna happen. I think I fought a zombie. Not sure if you're referring to a specific one. Oh, oh, oh come on with that. Oh. I don't know. I don't know. Is that the one where... Hmm. I think they might be in the Colosseum? If they're in the Colosseum, I haven't made it that to that spot yet. I actually haven't made it to the clock room yet. I think that might be where I'm heading now. Yep. Oh, these guys. Hey, Vidin Hawk 9. How's it going? Yeah, I just now made it to the, uh... Ooh, you got destroyed. Ah, these guys. These guys are worth a lot of experience. I usually grind out quite a few levels just by going in, killing him. Going in, killing him. So, we're... Now I'm in the clock tower room. So, I think think if I go... Well, let's get the little hidden items or whatever they are down here. Is there anything else in here? There's a heart max up. Oh, uh, this... I don't know about this, um... I don't know about that one. Yeah, they're tough. They're super tough. If you don't have, like, the Chrysogram or whatever, and you have to fight them with, like, just a regular standard... Ma oh, man, I waited too long. See, there's the clock. It's upside down, though, so I don't actually know what time that is. What time is that? Like, 12? It's like 10? Is it midnight? Oh, there's the time. You can check the time. What is it, like, the back dash? Oh, snap. Oh, you think that's the playtime? Yeah, maybe. So I think that goes to the Colosseum, I think. Oh uh, yeah, you can. It's a little tricky though. Yeah, it is.
Haha, <laughs> that's so funny. Get out of here, you. Yeah, I didn't know that either. Ooh, duck under that. Get out of here, you. Man, you learn stuff every day, man. Down we go. Eh, let's... I think that's a teleport right there, right? So, we got ourselves, uh... Hello, J. Muni, or Money? Yes, it is. I have it on my PS3, but my PS3 is... Down for the count, I think. Yeah, I was inspired to play... Give it a playthrough because of the, uh... Castlevania on Netflix game. Or movie. Four episode series, I guess I should say. I'm just trying to get to 200%, nothing too special. I'm not even trying for that, really. I'm just trying to, like, basically beat the inverted castle. Get off me, ghost dancer. Oh no. Uh oh. That actually hurt quite a bit. Maybe I can do a soul steal on something. Ring of Fenor, huh? Yeah, I just got done doing that part. Ring of something increases overall strength. Holy smokes, look at that. Jumps your strength up to 102. Oh, and everything else goes up. Yeah. I'm not entirely sure how you would how you would get past that part. Yeah, they do. I should have put the spike busting armor on. I th I was thinking about it. So, is it nighttime? Nope, still daytime. Yeah, one of those, uh, one of those things gives, uh, those relics gave me some, like, plus ten to luck, I think. Yeah. That probably would actually work out pretty good. So what's this way, boss? I think I'm gonna try to pull a soul steal off right off the bat. Well, maybe I'll let him come out of the coffin first. I think I actually have something that protects against poison. Topaz? Oh, uh, I guess that's not poison.
Guess it didn't matter in the end. Took that dude forever to die. Look at that, he's like still dusting away. Oh, the rib of Vlad, huh? What does that do? What did the con? I can't remember. Is that max health? I thought it was supposed to be max health. Yeah, it is. You absolutely obliterate things with this thing. The game becomes easy mode. But I guess after you've played it like four or five times. Okay. So we get a heart canister. I mean, the only thing more powerful than it is when you get the shield rod and do the little combo for the Alucard shield, which turns the shield into a weapon. Because it hits for 255, heals you for 8, restores a heart, and it gives you like a 2 second invulnerability. So, all that way... Was there an up in there? Did I miss a whole up thing? I think I might have. I actually don't know if I've gotten that one or not. Somebody mentioned it in a yesterday's stream. Maybe I'll have to figure out how to do that. Oh, it's just the the area in here, I guess, huh? Nine 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 attack, man! Uh, isn't two fifty five the max hit you can do? The Vandal Swords? Oh, okay. I think I might have gotten that one once before. Did I get everything yet? Okay. Is that that, uh... The Invisible Sword Lady? Or is that those dudes that, like, fly around? Oh, the Scarecrows? So that's kind of like in the... They're in the library, right? I think they might be in the library. Ah, uh, Medusa heads. Oh, well, they're not the uh, stoning ones. Ugh. He, these guys are funny. They make funny noises. Oh, I... So that's a life up. I think this is where the sword uh, familiar was. Uh, speaking of sword familiar, this is where the uh, heart refresh. That's lackluster. Yeah, this game is really, really good, man. So I've been playing Dead Cells a little bit lately, and I was like very inspired to play this then too, but I just was like, oh, you know, 
Dead Cells is a little newer. That Castlevania show, like, really got me going, though. Then I loaded this up and streamed it for, like, three or four days now. I'm glad I did. It has been super fun. Oh, that was a little trippy. Ah, get off me! Get off me! Sniper of Goth, huh? Give me a life up. I got this sunstone on. The unfortunate thing about the moonstone is that you have to like switch them. I mean, I guess you could wear them both, but I got this ring of Fenor, which gives like plus to everything too, and it's not based on times of day. So if I notice my attack is less than 102, then I know it's not, uh, improves status after. So it'd be, uh, day, dark, so nighttime. So I'll switch to the moonstone then. The ghost gets all confused when you turn into a bat. So, I'm not sure what's this way. Ring of Varda? Don't think I've gotten that one yet. I'm just gonna try to get to as close to 200%. Ooh, cloak. Twilight cloak. I think I like that one. I think that one is the one that death steals from you, right? Yep. Black Cape of Vampires. The Ring of Arda you can only get after you beat the game. Oh yeah, I'm starting to look like... Look like a total pimp. I can't sit like a boss in the chairs, though. Me and the chat were having fun with that yesterday. I was trying to pull off uh, one of the moves that the Sword Brothers move or whatever, and I kept sitting in the chair. Like, I know you own that chair, but I'm trying not to sit in the chair right now. Oh. So, do I need to heal? Just in case I come across that cat. I forget how you how do you get this sword familiar as a as a weapon? Do you have to max them out? I think this is going to lead to, uh, 
to a boss, I'm pretty sure. This is what boss? Medusa, huh? Uh oh, okay. Well, speak. Sword. I'm gonna switch back to the sword. So that was. I know. Rib, tooth, tooth. Oh, it's the heart. Avoid curses, huh? Did I have everything? Oh, I'm missing one thing. I think it is the, uh, bark? Doesn't the wolf form get, like, a bark attack thing? Or is that just a fireball motion? Oh, yeah, that's good to know. Do they get experience for the kills, or is it you killing things gives them experience? I can't remember. Poison? Poison me, huh? I think I had the power of wolf. Oh, I don't even know what level I am. 46. 99 the max. It's a magic missile. A walk. Okay, cool. So if they kill something, you get experience. I guess it doesn't matter, huh? That's so fun. So there's a teleporter in here somewhere. And a save, I think, right? Lightning mail. Strong against lightning. Ritual of the Night? What's that one? Is that a new game? Where's the walk? There it is. Miss something? Mm, yep. this go to the teleporter thing? Oh. I'll have to look into that. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not sure. I don't know anything. This, I'd be super in. But if it's anything like... So that leads to fighting... Dracula, right? No, that's the clock tower thing to get to him. So, let's see. This is the beginning of the map, actually. So, there's a whole area there that I need to explore. There's some fog of war right there. Guess I'll go ahead and grab that real quick since it's there. Actually, I'm going to get a drink. Uh, 
I'm actually gonna write that down real quick so I don't forget. That way I can look it up. Cool. Maybe I'll do a video on it. So we need to go down here. Do we not go there? Somebody needs to remake. Oh yeah, definitely. I completely agree. I'd say focus more on the RPG aspect too, like, you know, more a better inventory management, maybe more items. Yeah, it'd be great. That's what it's called, Blood Stranded. Yeah, I'll give that a look. Get out of here, skull, skull lord. All right, let's see. There's a whole area there I gotta go. It looks like this is fully explored. There's a little tiny sliver over there. Wrong button. We want to go that way, yep. Yeah, right now I'm looking forward to Pantheon, Rise of the Fallen. I'm hoping that that game doesn't flop. <laughs> that would be pretty cool. Man, they could do like so much stuff, man. So much. Uh, I think I can break something in there. Yeah, whenever I play Dead Cells, I'm always thinking about this game. I got a couple, uh, Let's Play videos for that game on my channel. Oh, spot I missed. A moon rod, huh? Still have not come across the shield rod. Oh yeah, that's right, the shield rod was over in the... Uh, Colosseum. i pretty sure, at least. Let's see here. There's a spot right there I didn't go. Yeah, I just keep headed this way. Yeah, he's the main character for the Castlevania uh, show on Netflix. Another... Ah! Wall... It's a wall pot roast. Oh, spikes hurt so much.
I'm still wondering how in the heck they're gonna defeat Dracula, though. He seemed like he was super powerful. Maybe it's got to do with, like, technology, and he's not really that powerful if you can separate him from the technology. Yeah, I think they didn't intend the show to, like, go beyond, like, maybe the one, you know, the, like, four episodes, so they kind of rushed that part. Oh, I don't need to be clicking those. I already did that. Yeah, I don't know. Get, come on, get, jump, jump, ah, stop hitting me! Go down. Am I going the right way? Yes, I am. Medusa heads get wrecked. At least they do a really good job making you feel like you're powerful. Because as you start gaining, like, all of the abilities and stuff, man. You f I feel like I'm freaking powerful as crap. Transform into, like, a poisonous cloud of gas. Turn into a daggum bat. How cool would it be to turn into a bat in real life? I only really know the story from the uh, anime outside of the vague story you get from uh, playing this game. So I guess I know that, you know, Dracula comes back every hundred years. Belmonts are cursed to fight or have to, like, you know, stop them or whatever. There's something up there. I feel like there's something up there. There's a door there I think I missed. Oh yeah, sure enough, there's a door right there. So what is this away? Is this a teleporter? It is a teleporter. So we're going to keep going up because there's a spot right there. It looks like I can go there. So maybe I can run back down to this teleporter after I figure out what's in there. All right. I'm pretty sure that I played uh, one of the first Castlevanias, like, for the regular Nintendo or whatever. But I didn't know what I was playing at the time. I just knew it was super hard. Bram Stokers, huh? That was actually a pretty good movie. Well, that was with Keanu Reeves, right? Oh, I know where I'm. I know where that is.
Oh, okay now. So is this it? Oh, no. This way. Good grief, yeah. I remember it was super hard. And actually, I think when you're... When you start this game as Trevor... The difficulty of that feels similar to how it was on the uh, NES. Like, I don't know. Alucard's movements are more fluid compared to like what his were. Also seems like his jumping is higher. Of course, you are a vampire, so maybe that, you know, is why. So we got ourselves a shuttle and a hammer. There's a heart canister. And this is where you go to look at the telescope, right? Oh, wow. Yeah, I didn't know that. I always thought it was the whip. I mean... He does have a short sword in the uh, anime. He doesn't. He only uses it for a brief time. He's pretty much uses the whip the whole time to snatch people's fingers and eyeballs out of their heads. This is where you get to watch that bird grow up and leave the nest and all that. I would have sucked to land into that. He's firing his laser. So we got something in here, yes. Dim sum. Teleporter to... Uh, there's a spot there I gotta go. There's also a spot there I gotta go. Oh, guess I can't. So is he from just the lore? Or was he like an alternate character in the one of the other games? Bones, go away. Oh, wow. Eh. Oh, oh, man, I... These... Oh, there's a spot I didn't go. But there's one of the spots.
So, like, that's where the story ends is with him. <laughs> but amnesia. Let's see, I need to go down and up. There's a little spot. Oh, come on, I tried to change into the gas. Ooh, what's that? Oh, that's that one executioner sword. That's number two. So we can go up there. Gabriel, huh? What is Lords of Shadow? Where's that fall in? I got a big poster on the wall right there. Castlevania 2, Lords of Shadows. up one more. Oh, it's just a save spot. Well, it's been a while since I saved, so what time is it? It is... Oh, man, it's almost 1 a.m. Let's see here. Yeah. Unfortunately, I'm gonna have to call it a night. I just realized it's almost one in the morning and I gotta be up in like six hours. Oh, uh, the uh, Castlevania 2 one? Maybe I'll give some of those other Castlevanias a shot on here. After I finish my playthrough of this one, which is near completion, maybe one or two more days, depending on how work goes. But anyway. I'm going to call it a night. Thanks for watching the stream. I'll talk to you guys next time.